I, I, I don't have it. Right at that lure. I got it. I finally got it. Oh my god. I just want to say thank you to everyone who pre-ordered a pin. They sold out in like two hours, which was way faster than I expected them to go. So thank you so much to everyone who pre-ordered, and also thank you to anyone who's ever bought merch from the site. I really appreciate the support. Now, if you did pre-order a pin, those are going to ship within the next week. If you ordered a pin and a shirt, they're going to ship separately, so don't be surprised if one shows up and not the other. They're both coming, but they're coming from two different places. For those of you who missed out on the pins, we're working on getting more right now. There will be more next time. This was sort of just a test run to see how interested people were. And it turns out you guys are really interested. So there are more pins coming. Stay tuned. It might be a couple weeks, right? Two. Two weeks, three weeks. Hopefully we can get them before Christmas. I don't know if we'll be able to get them and then get them to you before Christmas, but we'll try. So they're coming. Okay, now let's start the day. You know, when I say start the day, you might think it's morning time, but it's actually three in the afternoon. It's breakfast still. By the way, I finally sucked it up, bit the bullet, got the pixel. So far, it's a huge improvement. I can screen record, I can record in AR mode. The game never force closes because my phone needs to free up RAM. So far it's been great. Obviously this is not a full uh, Marcus Brownlee quality review, but it's good. So far it's good. I got it. I finally got it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is it there? No, Is it showing up? No! Was it my incense? Oh god. I don't know. I think it was a lure. Damn it. Just wait. Just serious? wait. Just wait. How did you get it? Ugh. Right when you said it, like, ooh. Rad. No? Yes. Yes. No. Yes. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. We finally got it. We don't have to go to Santa Monica. No, well, we still do. Well, we still do. There it is. <laughs> Finally. I have my ditto. What? That's crazy. 66 CP. It's pretty weak. Let's check the IVs. Okay, I cannot, I cannot have not it. Not good on that either, but it's gonna run. I finally have it. So Please check the Pokedex. Please don't run. Please don't run. Please don't run. 142. 142 is the old regional total. Now it's 143 with ditto. Once I get my muck, I'll have 143, and then I still need Lickitung for my North American Pokedex. Yes! <laughs> yep, that's it. Cool. 416. Dang! Yours is so much stronger. A lot of my friends have like weak ones. 416. Cassie's is so much stronger than mine. Mine is literally just for the Pokedex. It's not going to be helpful in battle at all. But it's still exciting. Good choice. What? On uh, where to eat. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> Next stop, bank. I gotta get this donation sorted out.
they just gave me the same number to call. But I did exchange my leftover yen that I forgot to do at the airport coming back from Japan. So I guess it was kind of productive. Look at this color. Can you see this? We're both kind of suckers for natural gradients. So anyway, now that we both have our dittos, I want to talk a little bit more about ditto mechanics. Ditto's signature move is transform, and it allows it to transform into whatever Pokemon it's battling against. So as soon as you send Ditto out in battle, it's going to transform into the first Pokemon that it sees. When Ditto transforms, it takes the base attack and defense of the Pokemon it transforms into, and it also takes that Pokemon's moves. But Ditto's HP stays the same. Ditto also retains its own level and IVs, and I talk about Pokemon level a lot, but it's not obvious, it's not clearly explained in the game. So the way you can figure it out is, every Pokemon has a Stardust cost to power up, and as its level increases, the Stardust cost also increases. So you can use this chart here, I'll also link to that, it's on Game Press, and it tells you the level of a Pokemon depending on how much Stardust it costs to power up. So, my ditto, 400 Stardust is level 3 or 4, or 3.5, 4.5. Cassie's ditto at 3,500 Stardust is level 23 or 24. Now as far as CP goes, that's going to be based on ditto's level, but the Pokemon it transforms into's base stats, if that makes sense. So to show you what I mean, we're going to head into this gym, it's a Lapras, 2,442 CP. This is a pretty high level Lapras. It's probably at least level 30. So when I battle this with my Ditto, my Ditto's gonna transform, but it's gonna stay level three or four, which means it's gonna be a pretty weak Lapras. So I'm expecting somewhere between two and 400 CP once my Ditto transforms into Lapras. Hopefully I don't get one shot and I can transform before it actually attacks me. It is going to die in one hit, because my Ditto is going to save, keep its own HP. Transform. 293, so there you go. So my Ditto transforming into Lapras at level 3 or 4 has 293 CP. It's also going to deal damage as if it were a level 3 or 4 Lapras, because it does take Lapras's base stats, but it applies them to itself as if it were level 3 or 4. Now, when Cassie's Ditto transforms into Lapras, it's going to have a lot closer to that Lapras's CP, probably at least 2,000. You're up. Okay. So let's see. Is this transform the second move? Or... Oh my 1841. God. So I was a little off. 1841, it's still close to 2,000. That's a level 23 or 24 Lapras there. That's so crazy. I have two Laprases. Mm-hmm. Sorry. She's mad because I didn't bring her back a Lapras from Japan. Now, it is possible for Ditto to transform and have higher CP than the Pokemon it transforms into. So, to show you that, I'm going to put a Pokemon that's below level 23 or 24 in the gym. I'm going to put this Blastoise in the gym at 2200 Stardust that's either level 17 or 18. So, when Cassie's Ditto transforms into my Blastoise, did you put something in the gym? No. Someone put something in the gym. All right, I gotta train it up now. Jeez. Okay, this should train it up pretty efficiently. This wasn't part of the plan, but we're gonna do it anyway. CP Dragonite. 
Never said it was going to be easy. That actually wasn't that hard. That should be a solid amount of prestige. All right, now, before someone else takes that spot, I'm gonna drop my Blastoise in the gym. 1064, that's the one, right? So now, Cassie's gonna battle the Blastoise with her ditto, and it should transform into a Blastoise with higher CP than mine. You ready? Uh, yeah. It's 14, 15. It's higher than yours. There it is, 14, 15. That's definitely higher than 1064. So, Ditto, again. Oh. What? Nothing. Oh. So again, when Ditto transforms, it keeps its own level, it keeps its own IVs, it keeps its own HP. But it takes the base stats and the moves of the Pokemon that it transforms into. It also takes that Pokemon's types, just in case that wasn't uh, straightforward enough. As far as Prestige CP goes, I'm not sure if it calculates that based on Ditto's CP or the Pokemon it transforms into. It's going to be hard to test with my Ditto at 66 CP, um, but maybe we'll try it with Cassie's and we'll figure it out. So to figure this out, what I'm going to do... <laughs> <laughs> to figure this out, what I'm going to do is battle this gym using all Pokemon around Ditto's CP. They're all going to have less than half the CP of my Blastoise. So once Ditto transforms, we know it's going to have like 1400 CP. But if the calculation is based on Ditto's pre-transformation CP, we should get 1000 prestige. If it's based on its post-transformation CP, we're going to get a lot less than that. Really quickly, I just want to mention here that since transform does happen automatically, you can actually dodge while you're transforming, as you'll see right here. So once you send Ditto out, you can just dodge those first attacks like normal and it'll still transform. You don't have to wait while it transforms. Just thought I'd mention that. Oh, I didn't heal it. Why can't I dodge? I don't know, it's weird. Maybe go I can't over. dodge. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh -huh. He didn't even have a chance. Alright, let's see. 89. Ouch. That was kind of difficult. I don't know, something's weird with her phone. There it is, 89 prestige gain. So it's definitely based on Ditto's post-transformation CP. So you're not gonna be able to use Ditto to sort of cheat your way up in prestige super quick. The prestige is based on its CP after transforming. Now, what now? This is a Zubat nest too, apparently, oh, which... Really? Kind of a bummer, but... Zubat could become Ditto. I'm not sure if it works that way as far as nests go, though. Quick water pickup, and then... What next? We're just taking a casual walk down Santa Monica Pier. Nothing really too exciting. Oh, hey. What up? Remember what that guy? <laughs> Sweet. I have a Go Plus icon just like stuck in the middle of my screen. <laughs> but here's a Kingler, 1780. And you know, Kingler with Metal Claw is the best Steel type attacker now. Beat out Dragonite with Steel Wing for that slot. Oh, got it. Nice. That was easy. Metal Claw. Golem? Yeah. Alright, cool. <laughs> We're just following Ben. It's super quiet out here tonight. There's like no one on the pier. 
and you know what really sums it up is not even all the focus stops are lured. So, oh, I'm out of range now. Most of them are, but still, not all of them. It's quiet. Thanks to, thanks to Nick here, giving me his personal hotspot. Thank you, man. Look at that upgrade. Oh, yeah. That's nice. If you remember from last time, it was like a really small camera, a huge, huge neck strap to hold it on. <laughs> A lot of place. Two gorilla pods. It's the better version of my camera with the mic input. But it's it's also quite bigger. Like Nick's is not is like goes up to here maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like two butt cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> you might have missed the golem, but there's three on this Go Plus thing right in the middle of my screen. There's three ammonites on nearby, and I think they're all right here in this park. So this is. I guess an almondite nest, which is cool because Omastar is really good now. And I still need a good one to evolve. There's another one. Ooh, 796. This could be the one. Please. Really strong. Almost there. Where's the last one? There it is. No. Dang. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna keep looking. Let's see where this one is. Right here. What? Hello? I only caught two. Well, I'm just gonna walk around the Poké Stop until I find it. it. Must be this way. I don't know. Yep. There it is. Please. I really want this. I really want a good Omastar. Second best water type attacker with water gun hydro pump appraise nope not the one i'm gonna hop on the self road though see if this nest has been reported i don't see anything reported there are a couple reports i guess they just haven't been updated since the migration all right that looks like a good one ammonite Report submitted. A little walk out there. Is I'm it down. worth it? Is it worth giving a chance? I'm down. We're doing it Blair Witch style out here. Uh. <laughs> nothing except for a two-bolt Dean and a Rhyhorn. <laughs> This is why I don't use trackers. Sandy feet for nothing. Sandy feet for nothing. But the other one was out here. This is closer. Yeah. I guess we should. Oh, this is one's... No. It's up to all I don't trust this guys. crazy new technology. Should we do it? <laughs> yeah, yes. I mean, what else are we doing? We just got burned by it twice, though. So I'm skeptical. Irv is like shown over there, mm. and it's like a little bit after that, so then I'd have to go down. All right, so like this part, and then it's like right here. <laughs> Got it? Got it, viewers? Should we do it? It's for the video, for you guys. Sandy We're doing it for you guys. <laughs> We're doing it. This is uh, attempt number three. <laughs> <laughs> I guess this ammonite nest just extends this really entire shots, right? park that runs down the shore. <laughs> this is crazy. Can you guys see me? Yeah, I need to stop for these because one of these could be my guy. And a sand slash. Okay, sand slash first. Hold on. Yeah, oh, thanks. You know what would be easier? Is if I just did this. We're gonna be here a while. Mudshot bulldoze. That's not what I want. Almanite. These Pokemon that stand really close, the trick is get your ball spinning and then just move your thumb a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit. How's this one? Oh! This is the one. What? I finally got it. Oh, I thought I thought it was gonna be perfect. Alright. 
it's above 80%, it's around level 20. What about the rest of these? Check this out, I'll show you how this works. Get it spinning, just the tiniest throw. <laughs> oh. We're gonna check it out. You going for it? Yeah. Ben's going scouting, I guess we're following. I really, I don't know. I don't trust trackers. Okay, so <laughs> we, you see the, the outline here. This is the tracker. Sandshrew, Sandshrew, Polywag, Machamp. Sandshrew, Sandshrew, Polywag. Benton 1. No Machamp. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Yeah. It's not here. It's supposed to be right here. But it's not here. The vlog outro. <laughs> The shake of the hands. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow, man. All right. Hey, Cassie. Bye. Great, great time. Carla. <laughs> ben. Yeah. Good night, guys. Good night. I guess we're going the same way for now. Oh, yeah, true. True, <laughs> but. Awkward. But for, the, for, the, for the vlog. <laughs> for the camera. Good night. Good night. <laughs> hey, buddy. Can you have fun? <laughs> oh. Please pay with cash or coins the amount shown on the display. Fairly uneventful trip to Santa Monica. We did get a decent uh, sand slash. Couldn't find. I'm a champ. There was a lot of stuff on that tracker that we didn't actually find. Vaporeon, Golem. I don't know. I don't use trackers. Ben did text me while I was on the way over that a Dragonite had just spawned. And they did catch that one, or one of them caught it. I think it ran from Ben. There was a Dragonite like an hour before we got here, but tomorrow should be fun too. I'm not really a big fan of the beach, despite living in California my whole life. I don't like sand. All right, let's go.